You ready to fight? Ready. Well, you knew somehow, some way, somewhere we would arrive at this third meeting between Amanda Nunes and Juliana Pena. As such, we are sold out tonight. Second meeting, not very good for the Venezuelan Vixen. How do you think she adjusts here tonight? She's got to adjust to the southpaw. It was like she had never seen it before. Amanda Nunes went back home, got to her, made changes that allowed for her to get her title back. In that fight, even though she dominated, Juliana Pena put a lot of damage on the champion, Amanda Nunes, and had multiple submission opportunities that could have led to her defending her championship. This is a matchup between the two best bantamweights in the world, and I cannot wait to watch them fight for a third time. Fast pace here in the early going. Nice little shot, Denise. Edge of your seat action as expected so far. Stuffs the takedown without issue. Just over three minutes to go round one. Caught that kick there. Double leg shot. And you oh, massive slam. That'll change the complexion of this one. That was a slick transition. All right, so Amanda Nunes getting off here again as usual. Really as well-rounded a fighter as we have in the quick entry here. Nice single leg entry. She does a good job of recognizing that the shots are coming, and she's got to get out of the way. Ground and pound the hammer. Mark Coleman would be proud. Champion. This could be it. Back to the feet. Oh. All right, so she told us in the fighter meeting the body shots were going to be key, and they certainly have been. She invested early, and now you're starting to see some damage on the other side. Yeah, she's doing a great job of following the game plan. She spoke to us in the fighter meeting. Could do it. 45 seconds to go here in round one. All right, so some adversity for her here. Looks like she has been opened up around that eye. Anything worth happening? She's hurt. So 130 seconds to go in what has been a pretty entertaining and active first round. Pena gets caught by that straight hand. Oh, she is wearing it. Bleeding from her cheek now. Oh, oh, saved by the bell. Huge shot stunner just before the end of the round. And now you see her walking back to that stool, a little bit unsure of herself. We'll see if her corner can get her head back in this fight. Might have been on the wrong end of a 10-8 there at the end of that round. Huge knockdown just before the end of the frame. All right, let's now look back at some of the action from that previous round. And she got knocked down, didn't see that strike coming. No, she didn't see it coming. She had taken a lot leading up to that. It wasn't one strike that hurt her. It was an accumulation of the damage she had taken that put her in that spot. She's tough, but let's see if she can turn the action around as we go forward. Second round underway. Oh, Nunez jabs. Oh, she's... Still stand. She's still standing, but she's got to get on her bike now. She's got to get out to the center of the octagon, find some space so that she can evade her opponent from finishing. Oh, nice body shot. Big shots being landed on both sides here. Attempt denied. Strong reversal there. Nunez gets back up. Lands to the body. Well, she's not slowing down. She has already landed a ton of significant strikes, and you got to think her coaches are going to be absolutely thrilled with this effort. Too. They're fired up. They have to be so excited to watch everything that they saw in the gym during training camp come together and put on this play inside the office.
Well, it is not the worst cut we've ever seen. And that will do it! Oh, my goodness! Takes the judges out of it, gets the finish. Jeez Louise! Well, there is going to be no denying her now. A huge TKO result here tonight, and this crowd is letting her know. John, you know how much I love to talk, and I'm sitting here almost speechless because this young lady looked amazing. She said she was going to get a finish, and that's exactly what she did. Wow. All right, the official decision is in. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at two minutes, two seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by TKO and still the undisputed UFC bantamweight champion.